Hi folks, we're back with more River Training. I want to continue on our last video of views. So right now we've got to set up some sheets where we can show these views. So I'm going to go into my uh, project browser, go to sheets, right click, new sheet. Uh, now we're going to just open this sheet up. This is an Autodesk sheet. Uh, I don't remember what size it is, but this is going to be our first sheet. So now we have, this is our, our entry level drawing, and then we had our level, no, not that one, I'm sorry. Not that one, we had our second level. So we had these two levels, basically. Well, not analytical, this one. Okay, yeah. So basically, what we want to do is, we want to get our plan views placed on the sheet. So for this one, this is going to be our column or our foundation plan, basically. So, and that's generally going to be the first sheet. So we got that sheet open. Okay. Uh oh. Uh, yep. Yeah, we need to name this, and we'll call this. We'll just call this foundation plan. All caps, or whatever you want to do here. Call is this because it's showing the columns and the beams and the shear walls. And I'll say, okay, you know they're going to be the first drawing, or either I should have probably called it zero. Okay, so now we've got our sheet, so I'm going to go to um, okay, let me see if I can grab that, drag and drop it here. Oops, sorry. One, probably not ready for that just yet anyway. Um, so there's our first sheet, and then we got our next sheet there. And again, there's our entry level, so that's the one I'm gonna drop on the foundation plan. That's really what that should be. Let's got there, oh wow, what happened there? Okay. But anyway, I'm going to use this drawing here. I thought I did that. I'm going to back to the information level. Nope. I'm going to right click here. Okay, that was the sheet. So here I'm going to right click and duplicate this view. Actually, nope. I'm going to go back again here. I want to put detail in this well. I'm going to right click, duplicate this view. With detailing, and I'm gonna call this one how much detail. I'm gonna call this my foundation plan, or whatever. Uh, this is the bottom for everything. Okay, so we go here. We rename this. This is going to be our foundation plan. So now we'll go back to that sheet that we had, uh, S1. And we'll just drag and drop this one here. Yeah. So we'll have this sheet here, and then we'll need to annotate this. We've shown that our annotations. Uh, so we got to clean this up a bit. But this will be the bottom of things. <laughs> uh, what scale we working with here? I like this scale. I think we can fit this. This will work on this sheet. So then we're going to just drop that there. And then we want to go. We want to annotate this if we like. Some structural engineers like it. Some, need, some don't. Maybe they'll do it on another level. But the main thing are the grids here. We got a grid lines through here and here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna activate this view and we can go and you could say tag all and we'll say um, uh, 
probably want to look at this later on because um, the main thing are the columns here and the we don't have any beams in here or reinforcement or span direction or but just for now we'll apply this and say okay so we have our columns annotated and then I'm gonna uh, go ahead. also we can probably uh, annotate this dimension wise uh, I'm sorry here we can just go to annotate tab dimension and then uh, line and then we know how this work we can go reference walls between grids or whatever activate the view I'm sorry and then we can go and add uh, different references so let's say entire walls so we have uh, entire walls we go to options here and we can say openings we don't have many but we might find grids in here I think intersecting grids yes we want that and we'll just select this wall or we'll select this grid line get it here okay but anyway for now we'll leave that there but that's basically our foundation plan so I'm going to cancel that I'm going to deactivate this view and this is our first drawing so the next drawing of course is going to be got a blank sheet there yep so now next drawing is going to be uh, our level one nope I'm sorry not that one our second floor that one I don't know why I called it that that basically shouldn't be what that's called but let's go and look at it in our uh, let's just wow let's do some let's do a window tile here see what we got all open so we got a lot of stuff happening here so what I'm going to do I'm going to just tab these views I don't need that I'm going to tab these guys I'm going to ZA here now this is my um, I'm going to do this I'm going to close it active good now this is the second level and I'm going to go to my 3D view so and then I want to go to a, a north elevation. So I kind of want to see what's going on here, because <laughs> the my levels. Okay, so this is the second floor, which is what you see here. That's the second floor. Uh, is it? Nope. The second floor is here. Sorry. Yep, this is I was the second floor and this is the roof. And this is just basically a concrete uh, suspended slab, basically. Uh, so the next drawing we'll set up is going to be our first level framing. So we can tab these views right here. And I'll go to my next sheet here. And we'll rename this sheet to First Floor Framing Plan. Oh, I'll just say Framing Plan. I'm not sure what level is it. I got to get that together, y'all. Sorry. <laughs> This is just going to be our framing plan. And we're going to say OK here. Now, OK, come on now. We're going to go back here. So, this is our second floor. Yeah, that's what we want to call it. So, our second, the S2, we know that will be our second floor. So, we have that. And then here we can go into that sheet, just drag and drop. 
this join right here, the sheet. And then we'll activate the view and we'll give it a scale of, I think we were, we were here, it was what, one quarter? Okay. So this is going to be our second level or our framing plan for the second level and our 3D view. Just want to de uh, cancel that. Deactivate this view. And this one, of course, we've got more dimensioning, so I kind of like to have the dimension on this one. Uh, <clears throat> okay, so now we have our two drums. We've got our foundation, which is here. And then we've got our framing plan for the second level. So then, you know, we were talking about views and things like that and uh, elevation views. Now, each of these walls will probably have to have some type of, uh, you know, structural framing or reinforcing. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to zoom these out here and start setting up our real view. So basically what happens from this point on, uh, let me tap the, you're basically going to set up drawings. So for instance, let's go with our framing plan as we showed in the previous video. We can do a lot of different things here. Uh, we can go, go into our project browser here. So I want to span this. I'm going to open this drawing right here. Oh. So there you go. That's that one right there. And I might want to tab these. I want to go in and do my work. Uh, I want to go in here and just, you know, set up some views. So for like for instance here where we were showing you previously um, the different um, sections and details. So for instance, let's go to the foundation drawing here. Let's open this one. Okay, uh, where is that one? So we're going to this drawing right here. So as you can see, we have different columns and everything here. So it's basically just a matter of uh, let me see where we are here. We're on our framing plan. So this can get a little. So that's our framing plan. And then we got our foundation here. So now from here, I kind of want to do it this way, but I think the foundation is better. So let's go make some views here. So actually, um, we have our north and south elevate, north, south, east elevations. We have those, which are there, there, and there. But the most important thing in a a structural model or this type of drawing uh, is the framing elevations. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to set up a few and I'm going to get these drawings going. So this is basically how you set up your sheets and everything. So we need to go next and go in and do all these elevations like I showed you in the previous video. So I, for instance, uh, this is my foundation. I'm going to activate this view. And let's go and do a uh, elevation view, a framing elevation. Say, we want to see how this wall right here is framed. Okay, wait a second, sorry. Okay. But anyway, guys, just getting a little along on the video. I'm going to leave it there. And we're going to come back and continue on with our views.
gonna look at that in the next video. But hey guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. It helps, helps me make videos like this all the time. Uh, yeah, we'll continue on. Next video, we'll look at our schedules and things. But this is how you set up the basic views. We got our framing plan ready to go. And we got our uh, foundation. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe. See you guys in the next video. All y'all be safe. Bye.